talking black tie events, what to wear, sharing not only some amazing dress styles to flatter your pear shape body from Rent the Runway, you are going to actually be able to see what these dresses look like on, but also some places that I like to shop in case you want to have an option on hand for your black tie event. Whether you're looking for affordable options or you don't mind spending a little bit more, I'm going to dress options that you can wear to your next black tie event. Welcome to my channel. It is your girl Jordan of Little Miss JB Style, your pair shape shorty style guru. And today we are talking black tie events because your girl got invited to a black tie event for her birthday. That's right. I'm going to be black tie fabulous on my birthday in just a couple of days. So I wanted to share with you some of the dresses that I got from Rent the Runway so you can see what they look like on the style of dresses in case you're worried about picking the right style to flatter your figure. And also share with you just some places that I love to shop when I am looking for more event pieces, whether you're on a budget or you don't mind splurging to have something that you can wear year after year after year. As always, you know how I do. There will be links in the description below. If there is a piece you are loving, there is a style of dress that you want to try or need for your next black tie event, I will not gatekeep. I'm going to let you see and look at them in the description below. So make sure you look there that you are loving and want to try for yourself. So let's start with the dresses from Rent the Runway. And the very first dress I have to show you, this ALC number, when I tell you, ALC is just one of those brands I absolutely love. I would wholeheartedly splurge on a dress or a piece from ALC. And you see why. So one of the great things about Rent the Runway is you get the opportunity to try designer pieces. And I think this is really important because a lot of the time it can be like, why in God's name am I spending this much money just for a piece of clothing? And when you look at maybe where it's manufactured or what it's made of, you might not be able to understand. But once you put on a piece, especially a piece like this, you understand why you're paying a little bit more because when I tell you this dress has the stretch, okay, I'm in a size six. This fits me like a glove, so immaculate. It is velvet but breathable. What? Like I did not feel sweaty at all. It held everything in place. It didn't make me look like a sausage. This was a really great dress and so I love dresses that are a little bit high neck especially because I'm not a big busty shorty. So this does give the illusion of a fuller bust and I love a leg slit. You cannot go wrong. Show a little thigh action even for a black tie even as long as it's classe. Just a little bit, just a little bit of thigh, okay? So I love this dress, especially with that little cutout, because I feel like that adds something just a little bit different than probably what you will see, especially if you are younger. I feel like when you look at black tie event dresses, especially from the older crowd, it's way more conservative, but it doesn't have to be super conservative. And this is a great example of that, where you have the high neckline. I'm not showing a bunch of leg because black tie does generally mean like gown length, longer length. So I still have the length there, but can still add a little personality to a little body, right? And so this is a really flattering dress. And the navy color is totally unexpected because again, a lot of people play it safe when it comes to black tie events. They're going to go with black, they're going to go with sequins. So this is one of those options that I feel like it's going to turn heads, but not because it's doing a lot, but it will be just a little bit different. And I can't stress this enough. I do actually have a pair of shorts from ALC that I wear all the time. You can find them at Revolve. You can find them at Intermix, Saks Fifth. Um, and I believe Neiman and Marcus also sells ALC. So when I tell you ALC, if you are looking for an amazing dress that's going to fit you well, that's going to look immaculate and be great for many occasions, ALC is definitely a brand worth checking out. So this next dress, I'm going to butcher the name, is a one-shoulder velvet sequence gown from Monique Lillier. I am probably butchering that, but you see the name here. I love this because not only is it black, which is on theme, so it's definitely safer and an option that will be timeless year after year, but it still, again, gives something different. The one-shoulder, I find, especially if you are smaller busted, can actually work in your favor in the way that this dress is cut. Like, I am not wearing a bra. I'm not even wearing, like, little stickies. Like, that's just natural JB boobs, okay? Like, and I am and I am giving. And again, the leg slit, you know. I love me a leg slit. I feel like do not sleep on a good leg slit if you are pear-shaped. So, this dress is something that I would consider as a more, again, classic piece. But you're still going to turn heads because it's something a little different. Most people are going to have both of their shoulders covered. Again, the longer sleeves maybe on both sides. So this still gives the elegance and the sequence is so much fun. So you can easily pair this with black accessories, gold accessories, silver accessories, whatever makes the most sense. And that's why this dress is such a great option to try out. If you're looking for something simple, elegant, that you can wear year after year to multiple black tie events. 
Another really great option that I got from Rent the Runway was this amazing gold number. How gorgeous is this? This is giving vintage but modern, very sexy. Again, do not have on like boob tape or anything like that's natural serving, okay? And you can see that it is giving, okay? And this is the gold Dara gown from Bagley Mishka. Super elegant. Again, this is something I feel like will be far more unexpected and you can tell that's kind of my usual style is I like to stick to the theme. Don't get me wrong. Like if you give me like, hey, it's got to be long. It's got to be this. But I also like to pick something that will be a little unexpected that's going to turn the heads. OK, so this is a great option. And this is, again, another classic option, I feel like, that is still safe in some ways because you are fully covered and it's just that back that is exposed looking absolutely amazing, but it is serving. And I wanted to share this specifically for my pear-shaped shorties who might be a little self-conscious because you can wear fitted dresses. Don't shy away from fitted dresses, okay? I think that very often we feel like, hey, because I don't have the hourglass shape, you know, I should find something that's going to make me look like I got that you know hourglass shape but you don't have to like this is super flattering and it looks super amazing even though i am pear shaped and i don't have the big old boobies to go with the big old booty okay so do not feel like you cannot wear a more form-fitted dress like this if you are a little self-conscious about your belly there is shapewear out there for you i have tried the spank shapewear and there's totally tons of other brands that you can try people swear by the skims one as well there are options for you if you feel like you want a more slimming effect but this is what it looks like and i have nothing on underneath at all like so again super flattering super fun super gorgeous and for me i personally like gold tones for my skin i just feel like it makes me feel like that girl goddess queen queen but if you are a silver person, go for silver. Again, if you feel like maybe black might be a little bit safer, get a dress option like this in black. But having that exposed back is something fun against something different and unexpected that is still very elegant and formal for a black tie event. The last dress from Rent the Runway is this amazing Femme Fatale red gown from Aiden Maddox. Are we kidding me? Like, look at how this... So I wanted to show this shade of red specifically because I do feel like a lot of people go, oh, black tie, I can only do like black, navy, maybe some sequins, maybe dark green and burgundy, but you can wear other shades and other colors. Do not feel like you can't. You can also wear prints. I just personally didn't find a printed option that called to me, but don't be afraid to have your personality show through at a black tie event. You do not have to just stick with plain Jane, dark, gloomy, depressing colors. If those are depressing for you, you don't have to just stick to emerald shades. This is immaculate. I love the drape. Again, the girls are girling. Like, I don't have girls to girl, but they are, they are girling in this, okay? And I love the drape. The drape is very, very effective. If you are worried about having a midsection, this will help to distract from that. This was so amazingly fitted. This is another one that I would truly invest my money in and buy. Another leg slit. You can't even be surprised at this point. If you've learned anything from me, get a leg slit. Just get a leg. Show the leg. Show the leg, okay? So I really love this option. This, act this actually might be the option that I go with. It is such a great color. Again, the back is covered, and that's the key when you're thinking about black tie is it can't all be out at once. And that's the thing with black tie. One, it is longer dresses, so you aren't going to have your leg out, but then you can't also have, like, your boobs out and your back out with your legs covered, right? You want to have that balance where you're still being, again, semi-conservative, especially if this is an event where you have maybe coworkers and people you work with, and even family, depending on your family. And I think that this dress really does have that balance of the nice plunge the leg, but not too much leg that I absolutely love. And the fabric is just so beautiful, so gorgeous. I feel like, honestly, I felt amazing in all of these dresses, but this dress really did do something for me. I just was like, I didn't even know I could, I didn't even know I could look like this for real. If I'm, I mean, I know I'm baddie, I know I'm bad, and I know I have body, but th this made me reconsider how I've been dressing just, just a little bit. So those are all the dresses from Rent the Runway. I am a size six in all the dresses, and this is a really great option if you maybe have one event a year and you want to try multiple dresses. Instead of spending a couple hundred dollars trying out a bunch of different dresses, this is a really great way to get a bunch of dresses. You don't have to commit to one. If there's one you are really loving, you can go ahead and purchase it, right? So... This is also another great way too to dabble in some of the designer pieces because again, I think it is important as you are learning about your style and understanding investing in quality, well-made pieces, this will give you a better idea of like what that means, right? And it doesn't mean you need to buy a designer, but understanding 
well-made pieces, what they feel like, what you should be looking for, will help you choose better pieces, even from fast fashion. So looking at some affordable places to buy some dress options in case you want to have something on hand, you have maybe numerous events you have to go to, I would suggest ASOS, one of my go-to places, especially for fun statement dresses. Here's one of the dresses I picked out from their site. I love the burgundy color. I love the neckline. And what I love about ASOS is they have such a range of sizes, whether you're tall, you're short, you're plus size. They have a great range no matter your sizing. And they have tons of options, so they have amazing jumpsuits, amazing dresses. And they have their Lux collection, which is a bit more elevated and perfect for the black tie function. So I really, really love this dress. It is a size 6. I felt like such a queen. And the great thing about ASOS too is it's $20 if you want to get express shipping. So I got this dress in literally two days and I get free returns. So if I want to try multiple dresses, pick one that I like and send the rest back, this is another really easy option to do that. Another great place to look to that I think a lot of people sleep on is Lulu's. They have some really, really fun options like this and this. I will actually link not just to Lulu's but ASOS, a whole roundup of just more affordable black tie dresses in the description below that you can shop if you are in the market right now. But Lulu's has, again, some really great options, some great color varieties for more formal events that I feel like you could wear beyond just black tie, whether you have another wedding, whether you have maybe a vacation coming up and you want to look a little more elegant for dinner. Those are the kinds of dresses that I gravitate towards. I don't like to get very costumey dresses because I do like to, as you know, wear and rewear what I own. So it's very important when I'm looking at a dress to consider, okay, yes, this will work for black tie, but I have this and this and this coming up that I would also wear this piece too and this could work. And that's something I would say to keep in mind no matter what you're buying, even again if it is for a special event like this. And so that is why I feel like Rent the Runway does make a lot more sense for a lot of people. But I am also very much like I will buy the nice dress knowing that I will also create an occasion to wear it again. Then a few more honorable mention places. These are less affordable but I would say we'll always have a great selection. Consider Revolve, consider Nordstrom, consider Intermix, consider Saks Off Fifth. They are gonna have a great range of dresses that are not just affordable, but will have more expensive dresses. But again, they're also gonna have a great variety for your style because again, not everyone has the same style. So one place might have some amazing dresses, other places might not be your taste. So definitely be open to looking everywhere for dresses and also give yourself plenty of time when it comes to a black tie event. I literally had a week and a half to get my life together, which is kind of why some of the dresses are the dresses I chose. But make sure that you give yourself plenty of time to look for the dresses, try on the dresses. What you want to wear and stuff might fluctuate, so keep that in mind as you're planning for your black tie event and what to wear. That is everything from the Rent the Runway dresses where I recommend you look for black tie dresses. I hope that you got tons of tips and tricks and advice what to look for in terms of dresses to flatter your amazing, beautiful body because it is amazing. It is beautiful. Don't let anybody tell you or make you feel otherwise because, girl, you look good, okay? And if no one told you, I'm going to tell you. And if you need someone to keep telling you, Go ahead and DM me, hit me up. I will always be the one to hype you up and let you know you are that girl, okay? With that, thank you so much for watching all the way until the end. If you have any questions, never hesitate to ask. Go ahead and let me know in the comments and I will do my best to answer them or make an entire video about it as well because I know that some of the questions you ask, a lot of people are curious, so never be afraid to reach out to me. And I really, again, hope you found this helpful. That is what I try to do, give you tips and tricks and advice how to find your style, how to find pieces that work for you, make you feel amazing. So this one area of your life is taken care of so you can work and focus on the other areas of your life you're trying to manifest and make happen for you because baby girl, they are gonna happen for you. It may be taking a little longer than you want it to, but it's gonna happen, best believe, okay? So thank you for watching and I will see you in a couple of days. Bye.